Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I miss you guys so much and I'm so excited to be here with you guys. Today's video is going to be about Motel and I'm also going to include some of my personal favorites and I'm going to let you guys know which ones I've been wearing the most. I get asked about a lot of these pieces um, through the comment section and I do see them and I try my best to respond to them, I promise. Um, because I definitely do not want to gatekeep. I do not want to be that type of person. I totally get it. A pile of clothes to talk to you guys about. So I'm going to try not to feel too overwhelmed. We're going to, you know, take our time here. Let's start off with these. These are my most requested jeans I wear in my videos. It's insane how often I get them. So if you're ever thinking about getting a low rise, um, roomy style, I definitely recommend these. Um, I'll mention the shade and the names on the bottom, but these are by far, I feel like these are the perfect like light wash denim. Um, this gives me like Pinterest vibes every single time I wear them. And these are, they do have a wide leg. This is their widest like leg pant jeans. And this is also a low rise. I do alter and sew the bottom. I have made a video on it and it's pinned on my Instagram for you guys if you guys want to learn how to alter them too. I'm not an expert, but this is what works for me. Hopefully it works for you as well. Highly recommend these. These are my favorite. Another piece I get asked about a lot is this skirt. This is the Cassini skirt. Um, I wear this a lot too and it's a low rise fit and I feel like it's really hard to find a good like low rise like everyday kind of skirt. I have so many colors. It's low rise. Um, for me personally, I do fix um, the waist size and I can tell you guys explain it right now how I do that Basically, this is a wraparound skirt, right? And there's these like the buttons are here and then there's a button loop So what I do is I <laughs> it looks crazy like this, but I basically wrap it around me, right? basically wrap it around me and you kind of get an, a feel where it should start here. So what I actually did is I, I moved the buttons, you guys. So just cut them and you can sew them. And then you can, so this is where the button loop would move here. And then the other buttons over here. Does that make sense? I feel, <laughs> I really do want to help you guys. Cause this, like this little hack, like, you know, was life changing for me. Cause I have trouble with the waist. Um, but basically I just, all I do is I move the buttons, you guys. So you can just cut cut them off here and sew them. If you want, it's completely optional, optional. but it is an idea um, if you guys are having trouble having the waist fit on you. Um, so that's kind of how I do a little like DIY home altering for their um, low rise Cassini um, skirts, okay? In terms of quality, I feel like Motel has kind of like a hit and a miss sometimes with their quality you really have to just um see it for yourself and also read the contents in their website um personally i feel like a lot of fashion like materials um how they're making clothes these days aren't exactly the best um just because it's very competitive with um, profits right now with moving on next item these bloomers every time every time i wear these i get asked about it or people say it looks like a diaper uh personally <laughs> personally okay that's really up to you to decide but they're trendy if you style them really cute i feel like you'll pull them off it just depends how you style them honestly and who you're with around <laughs> i guess in the way because you know it doesn't matter what people think okay just just wear them size extra small um i did have a extra extra small and they do run a lot smaller just because the waist is very snatched around the legs can be tight um, but they are cute and I definitely would rec recommend them for bloomers. I have bought a lot of bloomers, um, from other stores. Um, I seen some from like Shein. I seen some for also etiquette, etiquette. Um, and by far, um, the Shein ones are a little like big and looser, if that makes sense. They're like baggy and they feel like very like not good <laughs> not good um but the, and then the etiquette ones are a little more thin um but they're cute um and shorter and they show like your cheeks so um i definitely would recommend um the motel ones trouble finding these just keep on the lookout for the motel drops because i feel like they're gonna drop more um different colors another thing i get asked about a lot is their peyota dresses this is like a one piece kind of dress they do run short but i feel like 
they're really cute if you're having trouble finding out what to wear this is just a one piece you just throw it on you're out the door you know so you can always size up just try them on they are a good length for that mini dress uh, i see a lot of other competitors to try to pull off this dress and they run a lot lar longer and a lot bigger so um, just get just get the ones at motel because they have a more like flattering fit for like a mini dress long zipper here which is very helpful for getting in and then also the bottom i do want to mention they don't have shorts under so um you can either wear shorts under or go go all out side note um so on tiktok there was a video that went viral about um someone who went to a boutique and they had a lot of she and stuff and they're basically a lot of people were stitching saying um a lot a lot of fashion brands do this they, um, bulk and they also the those people who basically buy those sell it to other people and basically a bunch of brands end up having the same thing um so honestly this is one of the pieces i noticed this i bought off uh this i got off of yes style um and this is very very similar to the one motel has um and it, this one runs very very tight I'm not sure if this is the exact one Motel has, but I find it very odd. So I'm not sure if anyone would want to like confirm if this is also looks very similar to one from Motel. Remember, there was a Motel top that had a bunny on it. And Princess Polly also sold that same top. I don't want to I don't know about the price differences between those two brands. The same one or it's a dupe. It's so hard to tell now with fashion, but but I just wanted to share that. I thought it was super random, but um, it was, it's a bad motel, so I'm throwing it in this video. Anyways, let's talk about some of the new pieces. So this top I'm wearing is from Motel. Um, I love the light pink. They got the light pink shade on point. Um, it has little lace appliques on it. Um, the buttons, I would say, is the most annoyingest thing <laughs> about this top. I literally skip. I'm the type of person who skips buttons all the time, so... When, when you skip this one, you gotta like fix it. Um, it's annoying. This one doesn't have any zippers on the side. It's not stretchy, so you really have to unbutton it all and take it out. Um, so uh, that's the only downside, but I do like the light pink shade. I'm not sure if that's really worth it, but gray knit shorts. I've been loving the, the shorts and the adding like tights under them look, kind of look. I feel like those are really cute. I wanna add those a lot more to my outfits. I do like that the knit doesn't feel like itchy or scratchy, so that's a plus. I have short sleeve little tops. I love how it's not really as basic as like a short sleeve top. It has a little bow, it has like a little lace thing, and then also this flattering like underbust. Also, I've been loving like really baggy jeans, so I feel like I've been loving the combo of like a fitted top and then like baggy jeans. Really cute. I would recommend their basics. Their basics are more ribbed and they do run a lot like small get a size up and i feel a lot better the extra extra small does run really tight especially for the arms if you're getting a long sleeve top also got a pink and a red one um just because i mean i need some for work um but i feel like i've been using that excuse to just buy more stuff um but anyway shorts i love they feel really comfortable um the sizing is perfect it's always remind me of that picture uh lily chi posted and i can't forget it it's perfect it's yet minimal yet so so put together in a way she looks so like chic with her like little she always wear those like really cute glasses i i, I want those glasses knit striped shorts under and i ever since then i saw that i'm like i want knit striped shorts too and i i figured them out she hers are from brandy melville and that's what I feel like. I cannot wear uh, underwear in public, but you know, go, go her, go pull them off, you know. But anyways, it's the same idea, just the striped shorts. Um, I love these and I feel comfortable wearing these in public. So that's a plus. So got these, these look a little crazy, but um, they are in that like shirt like material and then the edges have ruffles. Um, they, Motel has been dropping multiple colors for these, um, uh, especially when they dropped, like, their new bikinis for the summer. They extra, extra small. Um, so you'll see in the try-on, um, but <laughs> this is in their grayish, like, color. So I guess we'll talk about swimsuits. Um, 
So I did get a few other bikini, well, two other bikinis. Um, I got this, this one with the bows on it and the gingham print. Honestly, I really like their bikinis. Their sizing for their bikinis are pretty good. Um, and it came with this bottom part. Uh, I'm not gonna do a try on because there's a bunch of crazy people on the internet and I just, I don't wanna deal with that, you guys. Um, not for me. You guys can always DIY these um, and make the little bows and then sew them on to your old bikinis. It's a fun idea. I've been doing them to mine's, my old bikinis and you can just pull them off like that. It's print um, color and I've been loving like those str strappy, like the ones that tie, really cute. Um, and I love the strappy designs of the bows from Paxson. They're really cute. They're, their sizing is true to size. Um, this one is from Paxson and it has um, the little floral designs and the lace and the bows. I recommend them as well. Um, and then here's also this other one. The other one from Paxson, this leopard print. Leopard print is back in trend again, you guys. So always keep your stuff that you really love and don't get rid of it because it's going to come back to trending. Anyways, that's it for swimwear. I'm getting off track. I'm so sorry lace tank this one has a um, padding jeans these are the blue green version really really nice color would we'll recommend these as well for sure jeans um i also have these black parallel jeans they are more of a i feel like a straight leg to me i've been really loving the baggy like jeans at the bottom um so these are more like a little bit more fitted which is fine Not a huge fan of black denim so i feel like that takes a part of it i'm kind of biased but um they're not that bad they're still really nice remember how i was talking about those bloomers yeah so there's a new version now this is the the red and white one with like the red lacing on the bottom here and then the bows and then here's another bow um so i love these what recommend the matching top so i feel like <laughs> i'm becoming one of those people that like when there's a matching set i have to get both because i feel like incomplete with you know just rocking one kind of like flares out in the bottom um really cute i feel like this is going to be cute um in the summer when it gets really hot and you have like a little like cotton set since we're on white um this like strawberry little tank it's really cute um they do have like their graphics um are very cute i feel like a lot of their t-shirts though let me give you an example their t-shirts i feel like this bow one also from motel and then this red one from motel are very high neck you know what i mean like they're very like high up there and i'm not sure if you're really comfortable with that that's fine but for me i feel like a little constricted um so just be just be aware of that because they have a lot of graphics in the same like high neck very fitted it's very fitted like all throughout um and they're more longer they're not really that crop like the shoulders i feel like constricted um i don't really wear these that often um but they are really cute um like designs i just feel like they need to make them like a little bit they need to offer more of a loose comfortable style because i it's a little too like tight just size up and try that and see if that works for you um i should probably start doing that pink little tank and it has a ribbon on it blank in the back um, but i do like it has a zipper i love when motel does this and it has a zipper so it's easier to get in because i feel like a lot of their stuff is very like not stretchy so it's hard to get in indie skirt and it has like this like close pleated design and it flares out like bottoms especially those brandy brandy linen pants that are light pink are going crazy right now um so i feel like this color is very popular would recommend these um i love the skirt the most though the purchases uh was definitely this mindy like gingham brown skirt from motel perfect with um uh, like the mary jane doc martens i have so would recommend these quality is a lot better than the pink one so i love this one too and that is the end of my Motel Rocks haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. Ideas for YouTube you want me to create for you, let me know, especially if it's informative content. I love, love, love to create informative content for you guys. I want to help you guys. So that would be great. Let me know. If there's a specific thing you'd like to um, share with me, feel free to message me through um, Instagram DM. All my info is in the description box. Anyways, um, take care. Bye, guys.